With uncertainty over house prices, there are calls for bold action to deliver housing supply. Having recently celebrated its 50th anniversary, the Hyde Group is aiming high and is looking to be one of the top five leaders in the housing sector by 2020. And as Sue Savile reports, the group is well on its way, with around 50,000 homes in management in London and the southeast of England. Pressure on housing, especially in the southeast of England, has reached crisis point. No one organisation can solve the problems. Solutions must come from partnerships, like those established by the Hyde Group, who've been providing affordable housing for more than 50 years. Hyde pride themselves on having created some 50,000 homes for 105,000 residents, building a further 1,500 new homes each year. A pioneering partnership with Brighton and Hove City Council is breaking new ground. Our partnership in Brighton and Hove is unique. We work with the local authority here. It's one of the first partnerships between a housing association and the local authority. What's unique is we're building a thousand homes, all affordable. Uh, no homes for market sales. These are homes for rent for local people on the living wage and for shared ownership for first-time buyers. Linking the living wage to a living rent enables essential workers in the city to find housing. We do have a really major housing crisis in Brighton and Hove and we've been working over the last five to ten years and trying to develop innovative housing solutions. So finding a partner to work with has been really important for us. Hyde Housing Association are a trusted provider of affordable housing and therefore it's been much easier for us to be able to uh, get members on board with this proposal. One Brighton resident benefiting from Hyde's innovation is Shana Pizarro. She has multiple sclerosis but feels confident about the future in her purpose-built flat. Everything about this flat has been so well thought through. The doors are wide so I can get through. There is plugs and sockets up high so that if I need hoisting equipment in the future, it's already got the electrics there. Everything is designed in a way that gives me peace of mind that I can stay here. Working in partnership with Hyde has been wonderful as they have, uh, they have a similar ethos and ideal around housing need in the city and that meets our own. It may look a little bare now, but before too long, this kitchen will be at the heart of a new home at a subsidised rent, giving access to families who couldn't previously afford this. The sort of solution that people we met in Harrow want. I think the government should build more houses and they should give a cheap rent to the young people. I live in a council house, but I'm just worried about my daughters when they grow up. It's not just a matter of putting more houses in the market, it's a matter of really making them affordable. Residents are the focus of what Hyde does. They voted in a ballot to keep the group in charge of the Stonebridge estate after Hyde regenerated it. I've had a very good experience with Hyde. They have been very good at listening to um, the residents. Um, we've given our opinions and our ideas were taken on hand during the regeneration. So. It was a very positive way of ensuring that residents were part of the, the whole area because they're the ones that were going to live there. Hyde's partnerships create not only new homes but new communities and can transform a contractor-based relationship into an ongoing joint venture, as with Chartway developers in Kent. The collaboration begins right from inception, right from uh, the opportunity, the, uh, the new community that we're looking at through the land acquisition, through planning, through sales and marketing, through customer care, um, the whole experience and we're able to share and collaborate in terms of our expertise. As an expert housing developer for more than half a century, Hyde Group aim to use their experience and vision to deliver more affordable homes with residents at their heart.